Hello everybody, so happy new year. I can't believe it is 2018, 2017 went literally so fast and it was an amazing year. So I hope this year is gonna be just as good for me and for you guys too. But I'm gonna start off this year with an organization video to organize your life because I love filming these types of videos and I've never done an organization one and I've recently been organizing my life so much more so I figured I might as well help you guys out and show you what I have been doing, so yes. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up for me because it means the world to me and subscribe right down below. Without any further ado, let's get on into this video. So my first tip is to wake up earlier and be a morning person and I'm actually going to do a whole separate video on that but for the sake of this video I'm just going to leave it as a tip because the earlier you get up the more time you have in a day and the more motivated you are so get your ass out of bed. My second tip is to write to-do lists. By writing out all your ideas and goals for the day or the week or the month makes all your ideas real and like you actually have to go out and do them, which you do, which makes you more motivated. So I recommend writing out everything so that you don't forget anything and yeah, it just, it's a way more organized thinking process. <laughs> so definitely write to-do lists. My third tip is to stop procrastinating because believe me it's easier said than done but by writing to-do lists you make your ideas real and you stop yourself from procrastinating and once you have finished all those goals you can get back on that laptop and start watching Outnumbered all over again because I'm gonna tell you I'm obsessed with the TV show at the moment and I've been watching it non-stop but Nike said it the best just do it so get off your bum and start working. This was obviously going to be a tip at some point and that is to clean your room. Clean up all those boxes and problems from 2017, put them away and start working towards 2018 and getting a tidier room because the more organized your room is, the more organized your mind is because a messy space means a messy mind and you don't want that. So make sure you just organize and clean everything up. As you can see, I'm just cleaning up this corner that I've been meaning to clean out for ages and I've just organized it all so much nicer and it's so much prettier in my room. So definitely clean out your room. Now I know this could be kind of boring, but believe me, it makes your room look so much nicer and that is to hoover and dust because I'm gonna tell you, I have dust that's been like sitting around for years and it ain't pretty. So make sure you clean everything up because the more cleaner your room is, the more cleaner your mind is and you just feel so much more at peace and yeah, it's just, it's a nicer environment to live in. So make sure you hoover and dust everything in your room. Tip number six is to buy organizers. Now I have got organizers for both my desk and my makeup and I swear they changed my life, especially the makeup organizers because now I know exactly where everything is and it always stays there and doesn't move about, so yes. Another thing that I also love to use to organize is mason jars and I have those for both my makeup brushes and these cute photo booth prop things and I love them. They look so cute in your room and they are so pretty and you can decorate them however you like. Now this is possibly my favourite tip but that's just me because I love plants so I have basically decluttered a load of my shelves and bought some more succulents so that I can plant them and keep my room nice and green and pretty because I just really love plants. They make me feel so much more at peace and at ease and they're just so beautiful, I love them. So if you can look after succulents and keep them alive I would definitely recommend getting yourself some. <laughs> Next onto organizing that big pile of clothes that you probably should have put away a long time ago. So I've made three different piles which are recycle, donate and put away. So keep your clothes organized and yeah, make sure you're not just chucking away like clothes that could be like donated. You know, all the nice humanly things. So yeah. <laughs> So you know 
when you go shopping and you just leave everything either on your bed or at the end of your bed? Yeah, uh, try not to do that. Try to put it away as soon as you get home because trust me, it makes life a lot easier and you're more organized. You know what, I don't know about you, but I was planning on sleeping in that bed tonight, so I should probably put that away. And don't just put it at the end of the bed, as tempting as it may be. Hey, so much cleaner. So my last tip is to help organise your mind and your way of thinking and that is to meditate. Now of course this is not for everyone and I'm trying out this year to see kind of what it's like. Maybe I'll last a month, a month or two, I don't really know but I've been loving doing it and I just find that it really helps relax and calm you and your mind is just so much clearer. I just, I love it. So I highly recommend it and I'm using the app Headspace. This isn't sponsored or anything but I just love this one so yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you did don't forget to give a massive thumbs up for me and comment something lovely down below and make sure you're subscribed if you're not already, you can subscribe by clicking right down below or right to the side here and you can watch some more of my videos here and here. I love you all so much and I hope you have a wonderful new year. Bye!